Hi guys and welcome to a look at today's Tom Brennan 5k from the Phoenix Park, the first race of 2022. Um, great conditions today in the Phoenix Park except for a very strong wind, tough on the guys trying to run fast times. Um, great race today, nearly 500 finishers, uh, super race in the men's and in the ladies. Um, hope you enjoyed this coverage guys if you're enjoying what you're seeing on the channel and you want me to continue doing this it'd be great if you would support the channel by subscribing like share and subscribe guys it'd be great thanks very much As you can see here, you have Kieran Kelly, Raheem Shamrocks leading out the field with Daniel Stone, his clubmate, in close contact. You also had uh, Martin Hoare, Jamie Gann, Mark Keneally, Olympian, uh, Stephen Fay, brother of Brian Fay, Sean Dorn from Clonliff Harriers. A really, really stacked field there. Some really quality runners in the field there today, and it, it meant for fast times. After the first lap, Kieran and Daniel had opened up a bit of a gap over Martin Hoare and Neil Butorski. Um, spread out the field fairly well there as you can see. Um, running down the first road into a stiff breeze, that nice downhill part of the course was made all that bit tougher. You can see people trying to uh, get into little groups. Anyone who wasn't found it tough. Laura Mooney of Tullamore Harriers, a junior athlete, went out hard from the gun and stamped her authority on the race and was never really threatened. She was chased hard all the way by Celine Gavin. Now the battle for third was, was uh, a bit more interesting in the ladies race as you'll see in the finish.
The youth of Daniel Stone eventually came to the fore. Uh, himself and Kieran Kelly are two absolute class athletes. But there's at least I'd say 10 years in the difference in age. And Daniel pulled away in the last couple of hundred meters. Now Kieran put in a bit of an effort there at the end and closed the gap to about four seconds. But um, Daniel was a clear winner. Martin Horden, clear winner or clear clear in third place. Uh, Neil Wozorski, uh clear in fourth. You can see here they're well spread out as they come to the finish. There's Mark Keneally, uh, Olympian. So like great running today. There's uh, Young Fay. It's it was a super race. Uh, great to see so many top runners turn out for the race today. Laura Mooney then finishing really strong there to run a really good 16.45. She held that gap between herself and Celine Gavin really well, even though Celine put in a really strong effort in the closing stages. Now the battle for third was, was quite close in the end with Adele Gaffney of Trim AC coming through to take third place. But when she did pass by within say 10-15 seconds, there was uh, about five or six girls uh, chasing hard on her tail. There's Adele now, as you'll see now, as she goes by when we pan back uh, out of the groups that come through. There's a lot of female runners uh, coming through and running super times uh, great race in the ladies great race all round today
There you go guys, another one in the bag, first one of 2022, always a great way to start off the new year with the Tom Brennan 5k, um, I hope you enjoyed that, uh, I hope you're enjoying what you're seeing on the channel, it'd be great guys if you could like, share and most importantly to subscribe to support and to help the channel grow, thanks very much guys, take care and Get the happy new year. <laughs> Well done.